Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks video. A few of you guys were saying, Matty, build a train, and I was thinking, maybe I could build a train. Maybe. Maybe I could. Uh, but instead, how about I use the train that I've already got and try and finish it, because that seems like a good idea also. Uh, so this is a train that I started as soon as the, uh, the train DLC, the train DLC? The train update actually came out, so, uh, yeah, if we have a quick look inside of here, we do actually have an engine. Um, if we go all the way to the back, we got another little cab, uh, and actually it can't really push anything or pull anything because it doesn't have any, uh, buffers. It also doesn't have any connectors. This is a speedo, and, uh, yeah, that's all that thing is. Um, I also want to put paint blocks in here that are actually, like, connect the angles so that it doesn't look so chunky, uh, and that would look kind of cool. And, um, yeah, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna continue with this train. Uh, I'm gonna make it look a little bit better. We're also gonna make it a little bit more usable because at the minute we can't really come through here because uh, there's pipes flying through the walls or whatever. Uh, so we're gonna change that a little bit and uh, we're gonna try and make it a little bit nicer. So let's go ahead and get on with it, shall we? Alright, so the first thing I want to do is I need to go ahead and mirror this, but I want to delete basically all of these pieces right here so that we can make them a little bit nicer. There we go, we'll do it all the way down here. Uh, we'll do it for pretty much every single one of them. Now I could suppose, I, I do suppose that I could angle these pieces as well in the middle. I suppose that would work too. Uh, but this is like one massive paint job that I don't really want to do yet. Alright, okay, let's, don't do, let's not do the paint job first. Let's go ahead and put some buffers on the front instead. Um, because that seems like a better idea, I think. Uh, now in real life, I believe these buffers, uh, are sort of hidden inside of here, uh, until the train needs to be pulled away. Um, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and delete this, and we're gonna go ahead and put some buffers in there anyway. Uh, even though we could, we could do with, uh, leaving them out for right now. Anyway, uh, right, yeah, let's go on the inside, and we'll build up some other things. There we go, put that there. We'll build some on the top as well. And, uh, yeah, that's on both sides. All right, cool. Then we just need some suspension. Is that what it's called? I think this is it. The piston. Uh, I think that's the right piston as well. I'm not entirely sure, though. Uh, let's go ahead and make it black. There we go. And put that right there. Yeah, that'll do. That'll do. Although it doesn't really poke out too much. So let's make it poke out a little bit more by putting one of those in there. Grabbing one of those pistons again. There we go. And putting it right there. Yeah, there we go. That's, that's probably good enough. Probably. Maybe. Yeah, sure. We'll go with that. Um, I do want to move the speedo, so we'll go ahead and get rid of that for right now. We'll just delete it, and instead we'll go ahead and put in a block. Here we go, we'll put in a... In fact, actually, you know what? We'll delete most of this, and we'll put blocks all the way across. Uh, like so. Like this. There we go. Uh, and that allows us to then put a pivot, a pivot piece on in the middle of there. If we possibly can, that'd be great. Uh, pivot. Yes! We can go ahead and grab one of these, and we can literally just plop it down in the middle. Now... Um, I can't really tell which way around this is. I think that's the right way around. Yes, indeed it is. And we go ahead and... Oh, we need to go ahead and we need to put a uh, connector on there. Uh, so that's exactly what we'll do. Electric connector is probably the best one to go for. So we'll just go ahead and shove that right there. We'll delete this again. Okay. And we'll make it come out a little bit further. There we go. So that it sort of works as a proper buffer rather than being behind. And uh, yeah, that should work pretty well. Nice. All right, cool. Alright, so now that we've actually put all of this in, we need to do the same thing on the other side. So I'll go ahead and quickly do that, and I'll get back with you very soon. Alright, there we go. We've connected this to the other side as well, which is great. We've got it on both sides now, which is awesome sauce. Uh, I do need the cooling to be somewhere else, so I'm thinking that I'll just put the cooling in the roof. Uh, on the very top end. So if we put it up here, we can, we can literally delete like a bunch of this. And we could put the... Uh, oh, we can't fit it though. We can't actually put it there. We're going to have to put it further across. Um, so instead of the cooling going out of there into two of these, we're going to go ahead and delete these. We're going to delete this. We're going to delete these two as well. There we go. We're going to delete that as well. And we're going to have to fill in this side piece to make it look the same as everything else. Uh, we'll make it white for right now. There we go. Then we'll go ahead and paint in all the pieces. Here we go. Just like so. And that's literally all I needed to do. So we'll do that. All right, cool. Then if we go ahead and we get one of those other coolant things... Uh, heat, we'll go ahead and get a heat sink, yes, go ahead and shove it on the roof, uh, right there, okay, cool, two away from the end, and I think it's three big, there we go, and in fact, we'll put it right there instead, that's good, we'll go ahead and shove it on the roof, and that's a good thing, there we go, we'll leave that right there, we'll go ahead and use the blue pipes, I think that's a fine idea, 
I think that is a fine idea. Because we'll still be able to walk down the side now, which is uh, a lot better than it was. Uh, trust me. It is a lot better than it was. Because you used to have to crouch and stuff to get to actually get past. And, and that just sucked. That just sucked quite a bit. Um, all right, cool. Go ahead and grab this. Put it like that. Beautiful. There we go. Uh, so the engine should work again. It should be cooled. And everybody's A-OK. -okay. Good. All right, now what I want to do is I want to get like a different color like this. I want to go ahead and get the paint tool. We're going to go straight down the sides. Um, in fact, actually, we're going to go straight down the side here as well. There we go. We're going to do it. We're going to do it this side. There we go. At this height, I should say. Uh, and we're going to do it at the next height as well, the next level. There we go. Uh, reason being is because I don't want this to be continued all the way up because it doesn't work on this bit as soon as I get to the paint blocks. If that makes sense. There's no angled paint blocks, so uh, I can't really do it. There you go. Uh, right, okay, cool. Now that that's all painted, I don't think that looks too bad. I mean, it looks worse than it did, but I don't think it looks too bad as it is. Uh, so we'll leave it. We'll leave it as it is. All right, cool. The top bit doesn't really need to be painted, so I would imagine in real life they probably don't paint the top like this. But maybe they do. Maybe they do. I don't know. I really don't know. Um, but yeah, as it is right now, that's a lot better than it was. So that's good. That is really good. Let's go on the inside. Um, see, the door is blue. I don't like the door being blue. I really don't. I really do not like the door being blue. Um, but you know what? That's okay. Right, let's go ahead and paint around these windows. Because uh, apparently that makes it look better. So there we go. We'll do this. All the way around the windows. There we go. And in fact, actually, we'll paint the windows as well. That's a fair point. That is a fair point right there. Uh, we'll do this as well. We'll do this one. And we'll do this one. There we go. Uh, it makes it look way better. Yeah, I, I agree with that. Um, is there a way of making these a little bit less bright? Because at the minute, they're super bright. They are super, super bright. Uh, and it says 1,000 on it. But um, yeah, that is probably way too bright. All right. Also, we're going to go ahead and paint this uh, behind. Because at the minute, it's white and it shouldn't be. So there we go. And uh, yeah, everything actually looks pretty good. Everything actually looks pretty decent. Uh, let's go ahead and paint these yellow. Yellow looks way better than blue. Yeah, I think it does. I really do. There we go. We're going yellow seats and everything. I don't think we should have a yellow seat. All right, there we go. Um, and we'll go ahead and paint everything else as well. Let's go ahead and not do this and do this. There we go. Beautiful. Um, I don't know what that button's for exactly right there. I don't know what that's for. Um, but hopefully it's for something good. Otherwise... What's the point in it being there? Alright, there we go. We'll do this as well. There we go. Pretty much all the way around. Beautiful. Wish I was mirrored now. There we go. All the way around as well. Yeah, that's that's a lot better than it was. Uh, we've also got this weird like little step right here. I'm not entirely sure why there is a step. So we're going to go ahead and delete the door. Oh, I see. That's why. That is why. Alright, you know what? No, the door is going to... Oh, that's why right there. Hmm. Interesting. That's very interesting, because I can't really put a step right here, because uh, it's not in the middle. Oh, now we've got a bit of a, a kawinky dink going on. Um, suppose that we could change that. We could definitely change that. All right, okay, delete the door. Um, let's go ahead and delete this area right here, like so. Delete this as well. There we go. I'm going to go ahead and put it on both sides so we can actually do some work. And um, we're going to delete this as well. Yes. All right, now we need a door. I'm going to delete that too. Yeah. Interesting things are going on, boys. Interesting things. Uh, so, we need a pipe. We need an angled pipe that's going to take it backwards. Yes. Okay, we're going to make it white so that it fits in with everything else in here. There we go. Spin it around. There we go. Good. We're then going to put one here as well. Uh, like so. That's good. Turn it around. Put it there. And we'll put in a, a normal one there as well. Good. We need a door, please. Give me a door. There we go. Got a door. Uh, we're going to go ahead and shove that in right here. Uh, it's not going to be blue, though. I don't want it to be blue. Uh, but it could be a different color. Now, let's let's put it there. That's good. Then we'll go ahead and fill this in again. And there we go. Beautiful. Um, now, we do need a button to open up the door. Uh, but that's fine. We could, we could totally work with that. Uh, right. Okay. Cool. We're going to go ahead and do this. So that it fills in the sides so that we can't see the stupid door as well. And we're going to go ahead and delete some of this so that we can actually just ramp up in there. Yeah. All right, cool. Um, also, let's disable this for real quick for, for a second. We're going to go like this down the middle. All right. And we're going to go ahead and add uh, one of these in there. There we go. Yes. Beautiful. That allows us to just sort of walk in and walk up. 
uh, which is exactly what I want to do. All right, cool. Well, also fill in these little areas because they don't need to be there anymore. And that's good. That is way better than it was. All right, fantastic. That is fan dabby dozy. All right, let's have a little look on the inside and see what that actually looks like. Open up the door, go ahead and walk inside. This looks way better than it did. And uh, we'll go ahead and put a block there as well. Ah, there's so many blocks that need putting in. Damn it. All right, okay, put a block in. Here we go. We're going to go like this, all the way up. Except from at the top now, we don't even need that, that space anymore. We don't even need the space. So we're going to block it all in. There we go. Man, I'm not used to this camera. I'm really not used to this camera mode anymore. All right, cool. And we're going to go down this side as well. Okay. And somewhere in here, we're going to delete a hole. Like right there. Delete that. Delete this side as well. Ah! If I could see, that would be great. Delete this one, this one. Go ahead and put in a bunch of these blocks again. There we go, all the way down. Delete the right one. Hopefully that's the right one. It is indeed. And we're going to go ahead and put a button in there. Yes! And the button is going to be a toggle button for the door. Woohoo! All right, yeah, cool. Bam! Right there. Go ahead and give it some power and stuff. And then it should work. Uh, fine. Yeah. Go ahead and power it up. Bam, bam. There we go. The lights don't even have power. Yeah, well, that's interesting. That is very interesting. There we go. All right, spawn her in. Have a little look inside. See if we can actually just walk through the door. It's not a double-sided toggle button. But yeah, we can just walk through the door now, which is perfect. And we can walk down the side of the engine. I should probably move the engine to the side. But you know what? It's okay there. We'll leave it there. Alrighty, that is actually pretty decent. Can I paint one side of this without it painting the other side? I don't think that happens with buttons, does it? No. Okay, I can only paint one side, otherwise it'll uh, it'll it'll ruin everything. So inside, it's gonna have to be blue. It's gonna have to be blue on the inside. I don't like that. Uh, but I could, just, I suppose, just make the whole thing blue, and that would work. Yeah, that would totally work. We can leave that like that. That seems fine. All right, cool. We'll leave that like that. That's good. Um, right, okay. So I wanted to make it more accessible as we come inside of here. Um, I don't really know how to make this work, but I want to be able to walk down the side. So what we're going to do, presumably this is the outside, unless this is just a block. This might just be a just a block. All right, let's delete it. Yeah, that's just a block. All right, cool. We're going to go all the way to the other side. We're going to delete this entire block, and uh, we're going to put this in instead. I'm going to put in one of these. Yeah, this will make it look way better and actually give us a little bit more room on the inside. Uh, so yeah, that's good. That is really good right there. Nice. Yes, feels like we got more room already. Okay, right. Um, now it's time to sort of deal with this situation. This odd looking thing. Um, right, okay, do this. Go ahead and just, just fill, in it, fill it in. Fill it in. Yeah, do it. Do it. Fill it all in. There we go. That's going to be like a wasted room. But you know what? That's okay. We don't need it anyway. We're just we're just a locomotive. We don't need any room for anything. We don't need any room for anything. All right, we should just paint things now. Okay, everything's going to be white. All the blue is going to be white. There we go. All of this blue is going to be white. There we go. All right, yeah. All right, cool. So the one engine thingamabobby is actually A-OK. -okay. That's good. Uh, don't know what all of these things do. I have no idea what they do. Nothing. Um. Okay, don't know why they're there then. Let's go ahead and get rid of all those. Um, this is fine. That's okay. We got a big battery right here. Um, there's not really anywhere else to put the battery, so it's gonna have to stay there. And we're gonna just block it in. Alright, there we go. We'll do this. Uh, we'll go ahead and block in the gearboxes too. We'll do this kind of thing. There we go. Go ahead and fill that in fully. Like so. And we'll go ahead and fill in this as well. Okay, so we go from there all the way up to there. There we go. Beautiful. Uh, now, I am going to try and make it look nice as we go along. So, we'll go ahead and put these pieces in, like so. We'll go ahead and put these pieces in as well. There we go. Try and make that look pretty. That's good. It's like a drive shaft. That's nice. That's nice. All right, cool. We're going to go ahead and put this in as well. There we go. And we're going to leave the top of it exposed. I think that's maybe not a bad idea, actually. We can leave that just like that. So, I think that we can actually walk back here now. We can probably walk past the engine, walk past the battery, and get all the way into the room where we need to be, uh, which is... Fantastic. That's really good. Uh, the only problem I've got right now is that this side is different to this side. So what I'm planning on doing is literally just copying and pasting this side onto this side and hoping that the whole entire thing still works. Uh, so let's go ahead and try and give that a go. Here we go. Right, go all the way down to there. Clear content. 
resize. Go all the way back to the door. Okay, because that's where we need to go to. Go up. There we go. Go down. Try and copy in all the bogey as well, if I possibly can. Uh, that would be good. It'd be really good. I don't think I can, though. Oh, we might need to go more sideways. I think that's okay. There we go. Go sideways. Go sideways. Have we got the whole bogey? We got the whole bogey. All right, cool. Go ahead and take it real quick. Copy that. Or, yeah, copy it. There we go. Turn it around. Take it to the other side. And paste it again. That's all we need to do. That is literally all we need to do. There we go. Hopefully that's the right area. Press paste. Good. Merge it on there. There we go. Beautiful. And we're missing a few pieces. What are we missing? What are those pieces? Oh, the ladders. Oh, yeah, the ladders. We're missing some ladders. Is that it? Is that all we're missing? I think that it. I think that's it. Oh, and some buttons, too. We're missing ladders and buttons. All right, give me a second. Give me a second. We can go back. We can go back to the other side. All right, and we can copy and paste it again. That's okay. We can totally do that. Okay, clear content. Make it wider. There we go. So that'll get the ladders and the buttons. That'll be great. All right, cool. Oh, wait, it hasn't got the ladders still. Why isn't it getting the ladders? It should totally be getting the ladders. I have to go out that far? Jesus. Okay, right, there we go. We got it now. All right, copy. Take it to the other side. Oh, do we have all of it? We don't. We don't even have all of it. We need this this bit extended. There we go. Now we've got all... No, we don't. No, we don't even have all of it. There we go. Now we got all of it. All right, Jesus. That took a while. That took a long while. All right, cool. We've We've also got no reference for where we need to paste this now. I believe it's there. I think it's there. All right, paste. Good. Merge it together. Yes. There we go. We've done it. We've actually done it. Beautiful. All right, cool. That's really good. That is really, really good. Because now we've got, like, buttons and stuff, and they all should work, and everything. Everybody should be happy. And, yeah, that is just genuinely actually pretty nice. Pretty nice. Uh, right, okay, good. So now that we've got all of that done, what else do we need to do? I think we should add some solar panels, maybe. Charge up the battery a little bit. Because we don't have any generators on this thing, so... Maybe some solar panels would be a good idea. Let's just go ahead and add like a whole array of them. Uh, right here. There we go. We'll go ahead and put a bunch of them up here. Uh, let's just do it off this wall. It's probably the best idea. There we go. And we'll add a bunch of them. Man, I should have copied and pasted this earlier, but never mind. Uh, we'll do the same thing on the other side in a second. And in fact, actually, we'll just copy and paste the whole array, and then we should be good. Okay, there we go. I've got them all sort of linked together. Now we're just going to have to link them to the battery, which is easy peasy. There we go. And now all we need to do is go to the copy and pasty tool. Go ahead and clear it. Go ahead and make it smaller, please. There we go. Beautiful. Go ahead and make it a little bit taller. Bring it backwards. Go ahead and grab all the solar arrays. Solar arrays. There we go. Good. Go ahead and grab all of those. Uh, copy them. Take them to the other side. They're all like in a big array, so that's good. Paste them there. Merge them together. And uh, connect them to the battery. That's literally all we need to do. There we go. Connect this to the battery. And voila. Everybody should be happy. Which is great, actually. Uh, right. Last thing we need is a speedo. A speedometer. We're going to go ahead and shove this. Uh, ooh, I don't know. I was thinking right here. We can just put it right here. In the, in the front. On the top. There we go. Seems like a good place for it. Beautiful. All right. Good. We just need to paint it yellow now. And we need to paint it inside this color as well. And that is all good. That is all good. Nice. Uh, we do need to link it up, though. So let's let's just quickly link it up to whatever the speed was. Um, do we have a speedo in here? Is this what the speed was? Oh, look. It's, like, directly in front of it. That is crazy. All right. Let's just go ahead and jump inside. We'll see if it still works. And uh, we'll drive it around a little bit. I've definitely cleaned it up a lot more than it was. Uh, side on the front. Let's turn that off because it's so bright. There we go, 1,000. 1,000 lights. All right, do the lights work? Indeed they do. Um, what is this, gear? Okay, I guess we got to reverse. Let's go ahead and turn it on. Throttle up. Turn it off. Beautiful. RPS is going. Engine temperature is going. Don't know what this one is. I guess this one should be fuel. And clutch in. We're currently not moving. Why? Oh, they both go in the same way. Oh, uh, how did I, how do I change that? Oh, I just changed the bogey around. Okay, I didn't realize that was even a thing. 
Okay, hold on. Let me grab this bogey. We need them both going in the same direction. So we need the, the filled in one going forwards. Like this. There you go. Hopefully that's in the right place. I don't think we need to do anything to it. Uh, unless we attach our brakes to it, I suppose. There we go. Let's attach our brakes to that one. Where's brakes? There we go. Beautiful. That'll allow us to slow down a little bit quicker. Um, when using two bogeys instead of one. Go ahead and get in the seat. Go ahead and turn it on. Throttle up. Turn it off. Clutch down. Wheel spinning. That's okay. Slowly put the clutch in. We are wheel spinning a little bit and sparks are going, but we are in a super fast train. And off we go. Yeah, I like this locomotive quite a bit, actually. We can clutch in a bit more. In fact, we can clutch in fully. We can throttle in fully as well. And that's what speed we're going. 60 meters per second, which is pretty fast, I would say. Pretty fast indeed. All right, cool. Anyway, uh, I guess I'm going to leave this video here. Um, we've done quite a bit today. We've just edited the train quite a bit. Uh, we haven't necessarily added or changed anything that much. Um, but yeah, it is it is a pretty cool locomotive. I like it. I might edit it a little bit more. Uh, the back end needs to work as well, so we'll end up doing that. And uh, I guess we need some carriages for it to pull. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. Anyway, I'm going to leave this here for now. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you guys in the next one. Goodbye.